All right, so real quick out there for you newbies, I recommend this the Noco Genius for your uh, you know to charge your 12 volt batteries up with. Um, what I do is I take off these alligator clamps that they come with, just clip them off right there, and um, yeah, you can just clip them off. And what I do is I add ring terminals. That way I <clears throat> put it on my battery with the ring terminals, lock them down. Okay, this is the battery I'm rocking with right now. All right, I lock them down. All you need is uh, the ring terminals of your size uh, battery for, your, for the ports, crimpers, okay. Then you crimp them down. You want to open up this this uh, insulation on your on your wiring, and just crimp them down. You know, get them to about right there. Give them a good crimp. I always give them two good crimps right there. <clears throat> what I also have is a uh, a port here on my door. Okay. That way I don't have to open uh, the back of my van. I just plug it up there at night. It's already, you should have everything already plugged up with your ring terminals on your battery. And all you do is just hook up your, your extension cord to the door. And boom, man, you're charging. So I had to get a new charger because this one failed on me. It lasted me two years. I think it got wet or something. I don't know. But it short circuited out. I tried everything to save it, y'all. I put a new fuse in it. Everything. So it didn't work. But um, now I got a new NoCo Genius, which they work very well. You just got to take care of them. <laughs> and uh, there you is, man. There you have it. Pressure Man bringing y'all some, some more tricks of the trade, man. I hope y'all crushing it out, though. You newbies out there starting off, man. If y'all got any questions for me, you know, hit me up. Let me know. And, uh, yeah, that's it. Pressure, man.